guys want to hear it, um, feel free to tune into the stream real quick. That way you can hear what I'm about to tell them. So, there we go. All right. I can't hear it. Oh, he muted us? What the f Oh, damn. Not that she went to the other room. <laughs> she went to the <laughs> other room. Y'all see the betrayal in my eyes? Look at that. The betrayal that he caused me. He he didn't even think to like fill me in. He could at least text me on Snapchat. Wow! She went into the other room and she heard the secret? <laughs> Damn, baby, yeah. can't fucking hear it? What the <laughs> fuck? Wow, <laughs> oh, betrayal in a nutshell. <laughs> I thought this was a team effort, man. That hurt. Oh, um, I and guess I people don't give a fuck about team <laughs> efforts. What happened? <laughs> I'm so confused. What do you mean? What happened? You walked in here and you were in there. <laughs> they can still hear y'all. You could have just said it in there, babe. Well, I couldn't hear what you were saying. All right. I forgot. To, I forgot to turn the sound alerts off. Podcast. My uh, off topic for today. <laughs> this is the oh, best oh, part. Oh oh oh. Oh, the oh I have I have an off topic. Too, oh, still. This is the best. Listen. Ahead. This is one of the best parts about this podcast. When we get to the off stream part, that's where we pretty much talk about anything and whatever the subscribers want to, you know. It's still, yeah, it's still on stream for me. I'm talking about <laughs> me. I accidentally closed it off. I forgot about the off topic session. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I almost did too. Uh, <laughs> off topics where it can get juicy. I mean, this is going to be a, a, the time of the podcast. I mean, you, we, can, we can take questions. And we can kind of try to comment on those questions. Um, however, there are terms and conditions to things we have to follow. So please be respectable. Be respectable. And let's respect the terms of service. Please. <laughs> no. Did you just say no, Nico? What the f <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, he doesn't care about terms of service at all. We, all, <laughs> Justice, we and you know about Nico. He does, Nico truly doesn't give a shit. Nico will hit us with a blueprint. He can get face fucked by cactuses. Oh, what? <laughs> what? Bruh. No. What? She was saying that last night when we were playing Call of Duty. Oh my god. <laughs> that was hilarious. <laughs> I'm kind of lost for what she did. Oh I'm going to die. I didn't even fucking hear that. <laughs> I said disrespectful people can get face fucked by cactuses. How, how does that work? <laughs> Oh, don't even explain it. Don't even explain it. I don't, 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 don't get it started. Don't 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 whatever you do, don't get it started. Nope. Nope. I'm good. I don't want to hear it. I'm good. But, man. I One funny thing I saw today. Should I go for I know this is like a bad. This is like bad, and you shouldn't laugh about shit like this. But do y'all know how like old people be falling so slow downstairs? <laughs> <laughs> I yeah, see. I'm falling and I can't get up. It's like they be trying. They grab on. Every <laughs> they grab on every single thing, man. <laughs> they grab every single thing and take it down with them. When they get hit with some late facial reactions. <laughs> Uh, they're gonna be wasted like GTA in general or GTA 5 to be oh honest. My God. Oh, that's hilarious. Um, What's tomorrow's topic? Spill the tea. I want to know. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we're still streaming, but yeah, so we need to talk about this. Tomorrow's topic. I feel like we talked about relationships yesterday, we talked about, you know, empowerment as well i want to say this was more of a motivational thing today so i feel like we should probably discuss i mean the biggest thing right now that's impact impacting our generation overall is like mental health and 
relationship. Hookup culture. Yes, we all. Yeah, we do need to address that. Yes, commit. We do. All right, so I feel like tomorrow's podcast is going to be like really in depth because we need to talk about commitment, loyalty. Tomorrow, yeah. Trust. Tomorrow, tomorrow's going to be in depth. I said, so. Let me write. Maybe we should save. Maybe we should save that for Friday. Maybe we Friday? should save that for Friday. I mean, yeah, because Friday. Way, Friday. Because I'm off Saturday, so I can be up later. So Friday. Friday podcast. It's going to be relationship. That's like you could call it. Say like breaking the status quo of hookup. So stereotype. I mean, pretty much. I mean, hookup culture is a stereotype. I cannot believe we didn't cover that the other night. That's the one. I feel like we. I I feel like we covered it. Yeah, but we. I think they want us to cover more for the next episode of this podcast. Yeah, like we could that. Yeah. You could straight up make that just a one topic and we could have an hour an yeah. hour conversation about how trash hookup culture is. Yeah. That's why I'll, that's why I'm dead ass hookup culture is. That's why I'm, I really want to get more females in here so we can like have you know per, more oh, perspective. Trust me. If I could get one female in here, bruh. Which one are you talking about? Oh, oh, oh! What are you talking about? Oh. Talk about. Let's get my ex-wife in here. Yeah, well, that hookup culture conversation goes. Um, hookup you know culture what? Culture is trash when they play you, Mathis, as fucking. well as your crazy ass hookup culture ex. Man, I got played for two years. Thing. Don't don't even no get sense. me started about hookup. Red flags. We oh, my buddy about- Mathis. My buddy Math is in, he's in chat. He, oh my god. You should come on the fucking podcast tomorrow, bro. Like, dead ass. Yeah, yeah. he could talk about what happened. We need to talk about red flags. I oh, yeah. We really need to talk about red flags. Oh, I know you have a shit ton of them. I just told them. Yeah. I was talking yeah. about other people's, not mine. It's supposed to be funny. I was to be funny. You either no. sleeping yeah. on the couch or you I guess it went out to dead. become cringe instead of funny. <laughs> you either, I think you I'm not right. on the podcast tomorrow. It's because my wife murdered me. With a lightsaber. <laughs> With a lightsaber. And not the fake one. A real one. She's actually a <laughs> sin. May the force be with her. Oh, what? Hold on, she hold on. May the force be with me. She's going to so murder you, me. So you're a Sith. Amber, so you're a Jedi or a Sith? I'm neither here nor there. Me ninja. What? We're talking oh, about Star Wars. <laughs> you can even, listen. The closest you're gonna get to ninja in the Star Wars universe is a Mandalorian. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much. Is a good show, to be honest. When they gonna come up with a new season, though? They just started filming it this year. I think it comes out before. And it comes out at the end of this year. Guess who's gonna be in the new Star Wars? No. Ahsoka, you know Ahsoka, the series? Yeah. Hayden Christian is going to be in it. As Anakin? Oh, bro, that's lit, dog. I, I, I honestly, the the lady who plays Ahsoka, she does a good job. She was in, like, dead. Oh, yeah, they picked a, they picked a dead ass perfect. And I yeah. saw her in The Mandalorian, I was like, yo, this bitch looks exactly like she does in The Clone Wars. <laughs> I mean, I mean there it's it's more of a realistic touch to it. Like Ahsoka, she had that weave, man. She had that. But so tomorrow we're gonna talk about red flags, hookup culture. Um What's a, another interesting topic that we can like Support systems. Support communication. Support systems and communications and I feel like I feel like another one could be like truly understanding commitment <coughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. that's perfect Mathis my buddy Mathis said he'd have a heyday with that topic he said what he said he could have a heyday with the topic of hookup culture I believe I feel like to blame for that, honestly, is like dating apps. Bro, straight up Tinder. It's right. straight up. Bro. It is straight up. 
Yeah, dating apps like Bumble. Oh, yeah. hold on, wait. Pause. <laughs> what did you just say? Oh, we can't talk about that app, or we're gonna get banned. Did that? What? Yeah. Bumble? No, yeah. no, 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 no. The the uh Jeffrey Dahmer app. Do you guys want me to hear something funny? What? So when Sister. I first met, shut the I fuck up. No, Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Shut up, B. And he wanted help looking for women. And I was very open with helping him. So I downloaded dating apps on my phone to help him. Well, needless to say, he got like 10 people that. Thousands of sexy bitches wanted this dick, and she told them all no because she wanted this dick. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, like these dating apps are like controlling people's minds. They're like what was messing. the last topic I said? Like, communication. Communi oh, understanding commitment. Yeah, understanding yeah. commitment. All right. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna tomorrow for these topics. No, these are from yeah. Friday. Oh, it's Friday. Oh shit. Friday. Tomorrow's topic. What should tomorrow's topic? Good. But talking about toxic toxicity in the men and everything, why not bring up toxic traits about women? You know what? This we is like this not is... getting banned. No, but I'm no. Down. no, 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 no. We can't get banned. Listen, we can't get banned. We can't get banned because we got a woman talking about it now. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. That's you see, perfect. You see That's where absolutely I did perfect. 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 Toxicity in women can be toxic, bro. I will have a heyday with that topic. I swear That's... to God. I will spend most of that fucking. Tomorrow I will break the fucking world record for talking about a toxic ass so bitch. To, so tomorrow it's generally gonna be a gender Eat debate. the city for that. We're gonna be doing a gender debate basically tomorrow. So bring your A yeah, game. Yeah, that's dangerous. Bring, that's dangerous, but we got bring it. your A game. Have if you got a my problem. What you say? Bring your A game. If you got on the couch, not my problem. <laughs> I don't know. All that I'm coming to your house. <laughs> hey man, you got we you can always chill on the couch. But uh tomorrow is a tomorrow is a gender debate and we wanna like try to get you know better understanding. Bro, I'm gonna understand. promote this at work tomorrow. Our podcast I'm gonna give them I'm gonna give them your stream and my stream. And then yeah. I'm gonna see how many people we can get to come into the stream. Mathis, we need to promote. We need to promote this at work tomorrow. I feel like this would be a good topic to come about, though, because you guys were talking about the toxicity and the masculinity of men. Why not bring up all the toxicity of women and the problems that they have now that you have a female in the podcast? I'm not That's gonna lie to you. I feel like women have a lot of toxicity because they're super emotional. This, this is the part of the podcast. Yeah. Topics. They get interesting. Oh, because and it's we, if and more. we say if we say the right things and we do what if we do it right, talking mm -hmm. about toxicity in women makes things skyrocket. Yeah. I'm talking like the littlest things about talking about the opposite sex will literally skyrocket you in views on anything. As long if you as have we the don't right turn fucking hashtags, if you have. The uh, right hashtags, and you're talking about toxicity in women because women, no offense, babe, absolutely refuse to admit that they are part of the problem, too. They don't want no, to I'm problem. I will admit, I had toxic traits. Do I shut them out most of the time? Yes, but this is gonna be even more of an interesting thing because I'm a pregnant lady full of hormones, and this shit's gonna get like in depth. Quick, if I were you, I was I would prepare to sleep on the couch. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to. <laughs> but, okay, it's comfortable. Yeah. I slept there many a night drunk. <laughs> hey, most people right... say that when women are like pregnant, they have like some. They always wake up with some type of attitude. No offense. Oh, I wake up and choose violence almost on the daily. As long as you're not eating yeah. pickles and ice Good thing I leave before good. she wakes up. <laughs> <laughs> wow, damn. I got to be at work at like 5 in the morning. Yes. I, I hated waking up at 4 o'clock in the army. That shit was the worst. Bro, you want to hear the worst thing in the fucking world? What? My new platoon sergeant 
just got back from being an AIT instructor. <laughs> You I mean, talk that's about not really shit. bad. I don't think that's really gonna be. Oh bad. no! Oh no! He's like dead ass. Like I feel like I'm an AIT. I feel I feel like AIT instructors. They're more of a uh, role model, and they, they you know they're they're more likely to take you under your wing instead of like putting you on the front. Yeah, he's pretty cool. He is a pretty cool, dude. Sorry, he's. Pretty, I'm not gonna say his name, but he is very, very, very smart and very wise. You know what? I, you know, now that you said it, I kind of miss AIT, bro. That was some, that was. Bro, we was chilling. Man, good times. We man. was fucking chilling. Hold on, we gotta share all the funny memories. What's his name? Drill Sergeant Cadoza. That mother. Oh who was Jesus! Funny. That motherfucker, bro. <laughs> Woo! Oh my god. Me and god. that man, me and that man had it out so much. Man, I will tell you this. I want to say like the funniest time at AIT. Probably when we were playing the fucking Warzone Halloween event with the zombies, oh, and we both God. about shit ourselves. Wait, you got to play that with Drill Sergeant Cadoza? Oh, hey, hey, hey! My buddy Mathis was at AIT the same time we were. He he got there literally. I swear to God, he knows who Drill Sergeant Martinez is. I forgot who that is. Uh, is that the short that Hispanic guy? guy? The, the short, short Hispanic guy? I think I left. I think I left before. before no, that. he was already there. Short Hispanic guy always drove the bus. Always wondered why I had so much contraband when I was bringing it up there. <laughs> Everybody, man, I was prior service. That, he, knows that. Drill, he, he knows drill. He knows drill. Sorry, night. You remember drill? Just trust me. I know we remember. You know, I drill. Sorry, night was a pain in the ass, bro. I can't remember a lot of them. I remember black female with dreads. Oh my god, she bro, she was a pain in the ass. She had, it's, it's like she had a fucking stick up her ass, dude. But AIT was good days, man. We, we did so much dumb shit that we got in trouble for. Yeah. Mathis literally got to AIT in so, wait, what, October of 2020. Man, they fucking flipped my bed <laughs> because I, I forgot. I, I don't, I don't remember. Book, I put my yeah, he got, he got there in October of 2020. I left in November of 2020. I probably saw his ass, but never knew who he was. Hey, actually, when you got to AIT, did they lock you in a room for two weeks and forget about you? Bruh. You want to talk about the worst quarantine time ever? <laughs> I got locked in a room for two weeks. I was going insane. I couldn't go outside. Bro, I, watched... I watched so many damn movies. <laughs> I watched so many damn movies. <laughs> I think it got to the point where I was like, I got bored of Netflix because I watched everything. I even watched Netflix. I'm watching everything on that bitch. I actually invested what? in on. It got so bad that I actually invested in uh, where's what is that Paramount when it, they only got like so many shows on there. Oh yeah. man, that was funny though. Yeah. That that was the worst time ever, and I did not like that at all. It sucked. Um, basic training memory: the fucking singing oh. the Halo theme song in the shower. Naked. Mm. <laughs> AIT eating Pollard because he's playing Halo, and I'm like, the fuck is going on outside my door? Is the master chief? Believe it or not, my roommates hated Bruh. me because I would stay up until like 12 o'clock playing Halo, <laughs> and no one did. Bro, well, dead I ass. To, I had to go there. Dead ass. Me. I ain't even gonna lie. Like I dead ass remember <laughs> it. I'm seeing. I can see it right now. I opened my fucking door, turned right. Pollard's opening his, getting ready to open his door, <laughs> and I'm like, hey man, that's some good shit. <laughs> Who's playing Halo? Man. You always came over. I don't know why you brought that PS4. You should have got that Xbox. Man, you know one thing I'm upset? I left that monitor there. Remember the monitor I had? And I locked it in the closet. Well, I left it in the closet for the next, you know, group. Ooh. I wish. Okay, I left. I sold. Remember that little TV I bought? I sold that bitch. <laughs> I, I'm so mad. I should have brought that monitor home, man. That just fucking sucked. That would have been a nice little monitor, too, man. I could have set it up and hooked it up to my TV. I'm upset. I hope it's in a, I hope it's in a better place because I was really, like, tempted to put that in my book bag <laughs> and, and explain to, like, TSA why I got a computer monitor in my book bag. <laughs> my buddy Mathis says, bro, that might be what I got when I got my room because there was... Was there a fucking monitor in the <laughs> closet? <laughs> that was my... <laughs> <laughs> was it in the Xbox? Was it in the Xbox box? 
<laughs> was it an Xbox box? If he says yes, that was mine. <laughs> Matt, was it an Xbox box? Like, was it sitting in the Xbox box with like my? Oh, uh, this motherfucker. He said, "Yeah." Oh my god, <laughs> bro! That's crazy. That's insane, dog. I left you like so much crap in there. I left you an extra ASU belt, some uh, boots, underwear that I never wore, <laughs> and a beret that I probably never needed anymore. <laughs> but that was hilarious. Dang, he got my monitor. Can I get that? Can, can I get that? Oh dang! I was about to ask him if I could get that back. I was about to cry. I wonder where it's at. He, he, ain't, he ain't got that no more, bro. <laughs> I bet you he does. I'm telling you, he still got it. He found out a way to get it back home. Bro, I've been to his barracks room. He ain't got it. <laughs> but man, the feminine. He said, "Oh my god." What? what? <laughs> yeah, he said the feminine guy in your. <laughs> Man, I should have sold it, but I also had a TV too. I brought a TV. Yeah, you gave you told you asked me if I wanted your monitor. You said no. Man. So he got a TV and a monitor off him. <laughs> man. man, I hooked him, I hooked him up, man. That's a small world, bro. Bro, AIT, can you believe AIT was fucking almost three years ago? Can you believe I'm almost at the end of my contract? Bro, I got I one year left. I got one year left. 2028. I was at the end of my contract almost. Then I re-enlisted for six more years. So I'm, I might be transferring to the Marine Corps, though. Why? Come on, man. You can't lie. Those uniforms looking like they smacking, bro. Okay, what's your favorite crayon and how many shots of glue do you need before you go to sleep? <laughs> Like, come on. You can't tell me those uniforms don't be having you like, damn, I wish our uniforms look Okay, like that. The, the dress blues are fucking fire. But I can't be a Marine because my dad told me he would disown me. Okay. he and... was a Marine. Okay. He was a Marine. Okay. But hear me Whoa. out, though. Hear me when out. the Marine tells you not to join the Marines, he doesn't. I mean, my uncle was a Marine. He told me not to join. <laughs> that was my first pick. Here's why. That was my first pick. I, already I didn't had, want to lose my dad, so... I already had a mindset. Rolled up sleeves with tattoos and possibly a trip to Taiwan or wherever the... You Okinawa. Know, Okinawa, yeah. Japan. Definitely. Now... How many Japanese bitches we could have slept with? I mean, uh, said they looked cute and went on about our way. Your, your wife is still here. Yeah. <laughs> 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 and she on mute oh yeah you're sleeping on the couch you are fucked I'm gonna die I'm gonna die you buddy it's gonna be like, it's gonna be like that <laughs> one you off the song they're gonna be singing guess who going to jail tonight me guess who going to jail tonight quick if I were you I would close the door and lock it right now <laughs> Bro, I'm in the living room <laughs> He said, I'm in the living room. <laughs> <laughs> she just casually you stole your monitor for two fifty, dollars Oh, man, you suck, dude. That That is a low price. That is the lowest you could ever sell that monitor for, man. Did you you spend you on did that better. monitor anyway. You could have did better. You spend on that monitor. Oh, she got the lightsaber. Oh, you're fucked. <laughs> I ain't scared of that lightsaber. So, let's say I got a bundle, right? I got them both at the price of 500 you spent $500 for a bundle? It came with the Xbox. It came with a TV, Xbox, and a monitor, bro. You should have. Okay, that's a good deal. You should have sold that monitor for like $350. That's like a 180p. So if you might as well sell it for $1,000. Double price. Extra money. I ain't gonna lie to you. That thing look like it get crystal porn on it. <laughs> <laughs> You see, <laughs> she just <laughs> quick. I feel bad for you. She that lightsaber must be her best friend, man. She about to. Yeah. She must play the Star Wars theme song. You can't force choke, bro. You're a Jedi. You're a Jedi. That's what I want. 
You're a Jedi. You can't Anakin Skywalker was a Jedi. And look where he he lo he became paraplegic. Uh, pretty much. I'm still streaming. Be careful. He uh remember when he force choked uh. <clears throat> Remember, he force choked her, and she, uh... Oh, no, Anakin! Oh, he lost the will oh, to live! Oh, yeah. <laughs> I feel like... Man, that movie was... Drill cool. Sergeant Cardoza told us to jay off, because there was a problem with this. What? 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 <laughs> oh, y'all had a problem with people sleeping with each other. That does say that does sound like some Drill Sergeant Cardoza would say. I ain't even gonna lie. <laughs> Man, I ain't gonna lie. That to man you. You was know, wild, bro. You know how many women came down on our floor with do rags? A lot. No, uh, that's how. You remember the one girl? I forgot her name. The short girl that was dating a super tall dude. No. You don't know who I'm talking about? Quick. No. What's like, her name? You tell me. I don't know. Salvador. But... You tell me, but not the, from the, white, little, the little white girl. I think so. But I have, bro. I forgot who the one chick I had a crush on, man. Oh, I'm trying to remember. I always hung out with her. Yeah. Oh shit! I know who you're talking about, bro. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, I know who you're talking about, bro. Man, I love that girl, bro. Damn, I should have. Should have got her information before I left. Dang, man. I forgot her name though. That's crazy. She was like, she was actually really nice though. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm telling you, those, those, those military relationships be hidden different, bro. I'm telling you. Especially when you get 12 weeks off when your wife has a kid. <laughs> I found that out. To, I found that out today. I get 12 fucking weeks off. Twelve cons I can have twelve consecutive weeks off of work now. You know you can sell them too, right? No, not fraternity leave because they're non chargeable. So man. I get I get ninety days of free fucking leave. Man, when I sold my leave days, man, I got like two thousand dollars back. Oh, I have plenty to sell when I get out. Especially if I'm about to get three <clears> months <throat> off of free. I also need you to know? I also need to get my disability. They fucked up my hearing, dude. I can't hear shit. <laughs> Bro, I can't wait to get medical. Good Good I'm gonna lie and say they got they caused me to have asthma. You can. I mean, I'm gonna lie and say my dick don't work. So. <laughs> hey, wait, isn't that, what? Isn't that like a hundred percent? Wait, what? I feel you get like, an extra. Like, uh, it's a whole like ten percent just for that. If you lose a testicle, that puts you. That could 50. that could that could be the ten percent I need, bro. All right, so you know if your twi your testicle twists and spins, like it gets tangled up, that's also a disability that puts you at thirty. I need to go back to the mine. I need to go to my provider. <laughs> <laughs> like, hey, bro, we got some issues we need to talk about, homie. Uh, uh, I got this weird twisting oh, sensation. <laughs> got this weird twisting syndrome going on. Here, and, uh, it don't work. So, uh, the boys, <laughs> the boys don't work. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how my future is gonna play out now. <laughs> yeah, I might have to get the snip, but oh uh, man, <laughs> yeah. uh, man. But I think we we covered everything. We got our topics. Tomorrow is the debate. Bring your A game. I'm gonna try to get as many females in here as possible. If you can, quick, I would appreciate it if you can get some females in our uh, podcast. And I'm gonna do the same thing as I mean it don't matter. I wanna get a large group. You don't of want me getting none of the females I work with. You get banned. Or okay. none of my friends. Man, I don't care. We go we gonna bring them. Bro, we gonna have here. like bro, this gonna be like a presidential style debate. Listen, my my podcast is for eighteen plus audience, alright? It's for a mature audience. I I put the little warning up. So. This question is advised, by the way. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I need to put that I need to put that in my shit. <laughs> I would hate for a kid to come across my podcast and we're talking about all of our army history, <laughs> especially the basic training showers. <laughs> like I imagine the kid quiet for I think that was the first story I ever told as soon as I got home. The horrors of showering and basic training. 
Oh, <laughs> uh, you want to know what my horror was? This could be funny to you. You're black. <laughs> the first time I ever took a fucking shower, it was me and like 12 other black men. <laughs> Did you drop the soap? No, I had the big dick. <laughs> Shit, if you drop the soap. <laughs> that's like the what? most. That's like the most horrifying experience of my life, bro. What is bro. this shell in a nutshell? Bro, yeah, I was like, I'm about to die. <laughs> it's it's like it's like you're trying to shower and you like trying to look up and not look down, but it's like. Pe- but at some point you gotta look down because you gotta watch the boys. Like so, like you in your head you doing like the whole math. Damn, this dude probably bigger than me. Damn, this dude got. And you're like, you're like, and then this is the fucked up part about that. You're like, you don't want to look, but then at some point you're accidentally gonna fucking look because everybody gotta walk out of the shower to go to the sinks to get the towels and shit. Like, it's insane, bro. Basic training oh showers are ridiculous. <laughs> oh my god. Man, the most what the outrageous. fuck? Basic training had the most outrageous stuff ever. <laughs> like, Bruh. <laughs> yeah. Like, when I got caught with... Bro. This, this is how I knew I was going down a very dark path in the army. Uh, It was the super tall chick that I liked. Her name was Mata L.A. She was Samoan. Man, like an anime. She Damn. was taller than me. And I liked her, and I was like, you know, we should hang out sometimes. Still got her Snapchat, by the way. She gonna most definitely see this tonight, but let's just say I want to go see her in North Carolina. Bro, you winked, and your camera went out of focus. You broke it. You trying? What you trying to say? You trying to say? Huh? Bro, you winked, and your you yeah, winked and your yeah. camera went out of focus, dog. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, I did it again. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, wait, it's not doing it. Are we oh, playing Call of Duty, guys? Yes, we are no. playing. You don't want to play Call of Duty? You don't want to do it. You don't want to do it. I got to go to bed. I got to ruck march. How many miles? Five. <laughs> oh, man. That's too easy, man. I, I, yeah, did, a ten, I did a 10 mile ruck march. We can play Call of Duty. We can play Call of Duty. I don't care. Are you streaming? Because I'll stream. No, I just turn the stream off. Well, yeah. so, so we're going to play Call of Duty? Yes. For the Please. boys. For the, you know what? Do we give her the pass for the boys or no? You guys. Oh, I have a pass. Quick, I know you did not give her a free pass. Well, free pass for what? For I the was boys? one of the boys before I was his wife. But you have yeah, to earn one. Of... But she has to earn the season pass, though. You know, see, it's a season pass for a reason. I am one of the boys. It's about the downloadable content too. How <laughs> 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 you about the downloadable content? How many DLCs you got now, quick? <laughs> huh? I said, how many DLCs came with this season pass? <laughs> Too many. I don't even finish downloading them all. <laughs> People probably got like a dozen of them. Downloading. Uh, more DLC. Can we get fun? No, we're okay. good. <laughs> all right. So the plan tonight is to play Call of Duty Modern Warfare and possibly have a brain aneurysm, correct? Tell people. Yeah, Talk yeah. by cactuses. Yes. I, I don't think I can Pollard, do another shit. Pollard, Pollard, Pollard. Last night I got 117 kills and only died 34 times on fucking ship mission. This is why I can't play shipment because people be running around with the shotguns, the snipers. That, bro, like, I did it with an assault rifle. I must play search and destroy. My problem with shipment is when I, I spawn in. When I spawn in, somebody already got the little uh, what's that helicopter with the the uh the, the Apache? Right, I think yeah. the attack chopper. Yeah, man, that's be killing me. Like, how you already got a veto, a airstrike, a Apache, and a and a uh, what is it called? The uh, the the little scram jet, the thing that scrambles your fucking uh radar. Oh, the counter UAV. Yeah, like, dang, bro, I I get hit with all of this at the mortars though. The mortars is what be killing me in fucking uh shipment. <clears throat> But 
I'm about to end the stream, guys, because I hate some of y'all. Some of y'all got some big ass heads, but I love you all, though. Yeah. Oh, and I know you ain't talking about big ass. <laughs> what you trying to say? I you ain't talking about no big ass forehead with your hairline. Yo, what you mean? Head. What I'm trying to say? Look at that receding head. Look at that. Look at that receding hairline you got going over there under that beanie. <laughs> receding. Hey, 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 hey! Listen here, brother. Listen here, brother. Don't make me get on you, Mister Jerry Curl. All right. Jerry curl. Yeah. <laughs> she, put you, she put you on she put you on blush. She said you got a ball spot. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> wow. Caught in 4K Ultra. Oh my god. Where is that? Quick, don't whatever you do, do not kill her with Stormbreaker, okay? You can't do that. Bro, I couldn't kill a fly with Stormbreaker. <laughs> the motherfucker <laughs> fell off the wall, I caught it, it bounced off the bed and then it broke. Don't lie to me. I had to duct tape it. D he's lying to you guys, actually. <laughs> oh, what happened I to Stormbreaker? Shit. <laughs> I, I hit it across my bed because I was hit. And it shattered. I had to put it back together with duct tape. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Hey, I was like, well, this, I was hey, like, this is this is gonna be a fucking multi guys like that anymore. Alright, so I'm about to end the stream on here and I'm about to stream on my uh Xbox because I do need to get some gameplay out. Cause I haven't streamed no gameplay at all this week, so Alright, brother. Alright, brother, I love oh. you all. <laughs> brother. Brother. <laughs> See you in the lobby. I feel like saying that word is so racist. <laughs>